Hey guys, what is up? Just a quick update to let you guys know, no, I am not dead. I am well alive. Uh, in regards to that Skinwalker video, uh, it did not kill me. I know a lot of you have been asking uh, for an update on that video, what happened afterwards, what happened before, what happened during. I will answer all those questions today and I will even do a video breakdown of what I was thinking during that video. So without further ado, let me just start. But before that, let me just say, uh, at the time I recorded this, I did not know it was a skinwalker. I did not think that. I thought it was an animal until one of my friends later on told me about skinwalkers and that he thought that it sounded like one. So that is why uh, the video was titled Skinwalker. I did not know at the time, so keep that in, in the back of your head. I thought this was like a fox or some weird animal that wasn't native to Iowa, um, which is where I live. We don't really have any crazy animals here. We have a lot of deer, a very rare black bear, a very super rare mountain lion. Uh, maybe once in a while you'll see an elk or like a, a moose. But it, like I said, those are all uncommon besides just deer, raccoons, foxes, and possums. That's basically what we have here. So <clears throat> uh, without further ado, let me start the video. Right, I'll just kind of, it has no sound on it right now, but I'll just kind of give it a breakthrough of what I saw because there are some interesting things. So basically, I am at my friend's house who lives near a state park, uh, which is a protected area of land, uh, which you can't hunt in. And basically, there's a river that runs through it, and there's a forest. But from where you're watching right now, behind this fence, there's probably uh, a few hundred feet where it's just uh, an open pasture with, like, some, some spruce trees or whatever. <clears throat> so there's really nothing to look at there. We had actually heard the scream a few times uh, and that's why I started recording. The, the, the scary thing about this is uh, when it actually screamed on camera, which is the one you hear, I did not expect it to be that close, which is why it freaked me out. When I had heard it before, it was farther away. It was way farther away, and it was like a distant scream. So that's why I kind of got freaked out at the end of the video. Otherwise, I would have kept recording. Uh, it was so close. I, I honestly was just like, uh, that thing got a lot closer, and I don't know what it is, so I'm just going to go back inside because uh, I, I ain't dying tonight. I knew that for my, you know, for sure. So another interesting thing to note here about this is, I'll pause it here when I get to, so right about here, if you see at the center of that screen there, kind of behind that fern, there is a white dot. I don't know what that is, but keep an eye on that white dot because something interesting happens. And I didn't also notice this at the time. I was pointed, this was pointed out to me after the video was shot. So I find this very interesting that I caught this on camera. Um, and then also, I, I didn't see anything in person. I didn't see anything. Uh, I only heard it, just like basically what you heard. I didn't see any movement. Uh, I didn't see a skinwalker. I didn't, I didn't uh, you know, nothing weird happened after that video. I didn't hear any more screams, in fact. We went inside, and that was it. We kind of watched from the window to see if we'd see anything, but there was nothing. Uh, so it was that scream, and it was done. Um, so I'll play the video again. And I'm basically right there pointing at that fern, as you heard me say in the video. Not the light. I did not see that light. Or I didn't notice it. I mean, I'm sure it was there. I just don't remember noticing it. Um, so you're about to hear the scream, which I have muted because for, you know, I'm just trying to break this down. So basically, when the scream happens, keep an eye on that white light uh, right there. So let me, let me pause it. So that white light right there, keep an eye on that. And notice what happens to that after uh, the scream happens or during. It happens really quick. So that, that white light just darts down, as you can see, and that is pretty terrifying. Uh, I don't know what that is. Um, I guess an, an idea I was I had was maybe when that scream happened, uh, there was an animal in that tree, like a raccoon or a possum or, or a, a rodent of some kind, and that scream was so close that it spooked it and it jumped down. That's the only thing I can think of. I, I don't think that was a skinwalker I don't know I mean it didn't make any noise and I would have heard it if it was a big creature in that tree um, I didn't hear anything I would have heard the the noise of it moving like that so I don't know maybe they don't make any noise I'm not really sure but that's basically an update on what happened in that video I've had several people contact me about the footage um, uh, if you if, if you want to use the footage go ahead I don't care uh, I, like I said I didn't die it didn't attack me I didn't see it. Um, it was in Iowa, if you're wondering, Cedar Falls, Iowa, uh, near George With State Memorial Park. Uh, if you have any other questions, just let me know in the comments down below and I'll answer them. Also, if you want me to do
do more Skinwalker videos or more reaction videos, um, let me know in the comments below because I will do those, or any videos for that matter, if you want to see me do uh, any anything, send ideas, send whatever, and I'll, I'll, I'll take a look at it and see what I can do. So with all that being said, I'll see you guys in the next video.